I'm not coming home, am I? So that entire clip was recorded and created by Kling Omni, brand new AI video feature that has come to Kling, and we're going to dive into that today in this video. My name is Jared. I'm an AI educator and content creator in the space. I do a lot of tutorial stuff, and I'm very happy that Kling has helped sponsor this video to help me talk to you about the new Omni 01. Uh, it's a fantastic model that Kling have released, and it has a few different touches to it compared to other video models out there. The way this model stands out is it focuses on modifying images and video on the video element this allows you to upload a short video that you've created and you can make modifications using text or you can also bring in different elements and images to alter the scene as well and this is all done on cling in this example here we have a video of a man walking just down the street and i wanted to put this suit on him i got a picture of a suit and i said in the prompt the man is wearing the suit and the video stays the same, keeping the same composition, but it alters what the person is wearing seamlessly. And it's a really cool way to get those little edits in your video if something just wasn't quite right. Here's another example of just using a text prompt saying this person walking has long uh, white hair instead of just normal hair. Now you can use more than one element. So in this case, I wanted to use this white shirt and I wanted to use a hat. I didn't even include a picture of a person, but I included both elements in the prompt. And I said, hey, create a person, a woman walking through a park, wearing these items of clothing. And it was able to do that for me. So it's a great way to combine things together, like different elements and ingredients, while keeping a very strong quality of video output. One of my favorite features of Kling Omni or One is the way that it can add, remove, and alter a scene. So in this scene here of someone pouring water, I can do things like add a cat, I can remove the cup, I can change what the person's holding, and on top of that, I can even change the angle of the shot whilst keeping the composition of the video as well. Uh, it's very cool being able to do this because you can get very cinematic kind of shots from one video. An example here of a person jumping off this ice cliff into the water. The, the second shot, lower to the ground, seeing him jump, that was a prompt for that original video of him just jumping, saying, hey, I want a lower camera angle shot where the camera's low to the water, looking up and tracking him. More examples of editing a scene to get a different camera angle. So from that one video, I can prompt for it to be closer to someone's face before revealing the wider scene, or going the other way where it starts close and going out to reveal that final scene or going in. So it's a lot of ways you can use Omni here to edit and modify videos. And for me, the favorite feature still is how you can change those camera angles and still maintain a really good quality, especially with consistency.